Paraguayan swimmer Luana Alonso confirmed that she is retiring from the sport at the age of 20 after an emotional interview at the Olympics, in which she apologized to her country. She took to Instagram after finishing 6th in the 100M Women's Butterfly, 0.24 seconds behind Georgia's Anna Nitsarods, which ensured that she narrowly missed out on qualifying for the semi-finals. Her statement on social media read, It's official now. I'm retiring from swimming, thank you all so much for the support. Sorry Paraguay, I only have to thank you. Shortly after getting out of the water, Alonso spoke with Paraguayan outlet Claro Sport for what she described as an emotional interview, saying sorry for not qualifying. I am very emotional because it was my last race, I am retiring from swimming, she said. I have been swimming for so long, 18 years, and I have so many feelings. Unfortunately, I made the decision to stop and I am happy that my last race will be at the Olympic Games. It didn't happen the way I wanted it to. I sincerely apologize to Paraguay, but I did what I could, despite several things that happened to me before. So, I'm happy and also to retire here with a full stadium and finally have the Olympic Games. Alonso confirmed that she will next head to the United States to study political science at Southern Methodist University near Dallas, Texas, with the ambition to help her fellow sports people in an official capacity. I'm going to go to study in the United States, to continue with my career in political science and, why not, to be a minister of the court one day because, as an athlete, I know what all athletes suffer and I want to help them promote sport, she added. Claro Sport producer Walter Estigaribia claimed that Alonso was in tears when she spoke to the broadcaster. Despite the curious nature of her exit from swimming, the 20-year-old clarified that her performance in Paris did not impact any decision to retire and she had not made a snap decision. She said, People, my decision was made a long time ago. It wasn't because of the games. So nothing, I just have to thank everyone who always supported me.